name is Ebony Iman Dallas, and I'm an artist, and I'm also the founder and executive director of African Nation Artist Organization, which is a local NGO um, and nonprofit based in Hergesa. First of all, I would say thank you, and I would like to let you all know how truly honored I am to receive your recognition in the She Rose Art Exhibition in Oakland. Um, that's, you know, I love Oakland. I've truly flourished as an artist in Oakland, and no matter how far I go, it will never leave my heart. Um, thank you so much for your honor and your recognition. You know, for the past seven months I've been here in Hergesa and working full-time with African Nation Artist Organization as a volunteer. So when you, when you give people, you know, the recognition and just say thank you, sometimes it's the motivation that's needed to, to continue at a fast pace, because <laughs> it's not always easy. But, um, so, uh, uh, you know, thank you. Um, African Nation Artist Organization, we've been working for the past two years here in Hergesa um, to restore and support past, present, and future Somali art culture. Um, we've done that through arts education. We have art classes for youth. We also have professional development workshops where artists come, professional artists come in and they use art supplies that we've collected in Oakland. Most of them were collected in Oakland, but literally around the world as well. Um, and we also have professional development opportunities, um, fair trade opportunities through our art gallery, which we just opened here in Hergesa um, in December of 2011. And we also do a lot of community outreach and involvement. So we do themed art shows. Our current art show is dealing with issues of migration. Um, there's a lot of youth, hundreds and even thousands of youth who every single year they choose to go travel as far as through the Sahara Desert, through Sudan, through Libya, just to take a boat that may or may not make its destination in Europe. And they also take another um, strenuous path up through, a lot of people come through Ethiopia, from Ethiopia, through Somalia, up through the north and out through Djibouti to try to go to Yemen. And there's many deaths that um, happen every single year. Um, so that's one of the ways that we choose to, um, you know, create positive change through art here in our community. And we also have done a, um, a, an international art exchange exhibition which took place between Oakland artists and artists that are here. And so through that we were able to, you know, allow artists to have a conversation through art. So mostly through visual art, but there was also artists that did um, dance and fashion as well as a collaboration around the theme of family rituals and tradition. So this is a wonderful way for to you know build a bridge between our communities and um, learn more about each other through positive means. Um, and one of our participants this year was Alicia, Bud, whose artwork is being showcased. Um, at the She Rose exhibition as well. Alicia is a dynamic artist. Um, she lives in the San Francisco Bay Area, and she did a collaboration with an artist here named Hannes. Um, Alicia Va, she chose to portray the image of a person being uprooted in, you know, in travel. So in her image, it's about it's in transit, and in turn. Hanid took her piece of artwork along with all the information that was given about her and he created a beautiful piece that also discussed issues of transition, issues of, um, of um, learning and growing into yourself. And so, you know, these are some of the ways that we've chose to build bridges and also it's a way to create positive change through art. So again, I say thank you. It's truly an honor. It's a blessing. And I hope you all enjoy your day.